Mass readings for Wednesday, June 7, 2023. Ordinary Weekday. Lectionary, 355. First reading, Tobit 3, verses 1 to 11a and 16 to 17a. Then Tobias sighed, and began to pray with tears, saying, Thou art just, O Lord, and all thy judgments are just, and all thy ways mercy, and truth, and judgment. And now, O Lord, think of me, and take not revenge of my sins, neither remember my offenses, nor those of my parents. For we have not obeyed thy commandments, therefore are we delivered to spoil and to captivity, and death, and are made a fable, and a reproach to all nations, amongst which thou hast scattered us. And now, O Lord, great are thy judgments, because we have not done according to thy precepts, and have not walked sincerely before thee. And now, O Lord, do with me according to thy will, and command my spirit to be received in peace, for it is better for me to die, than to live. Now it happened on the same day, that Sarah daughter of Ragel, in rages a city of the Medes, received a reproach from one of her father's servant maids. Because she had been given to seven husbands, and a devil named Asmodeus had killed them, at their first going in unto her. So when she reproved the maid for her fault, she answered her, saying, May we never see son, or daughter of thee upon the earth, thou murderer of thy husbands. Wilt thou kill me also, as thou hast already killed seven husbands? At these words she went into an upper chamber of her house, and for three days and three nights did neither eat nor drink. But continuing in prayer with tears besought God, that he would deliver her from this reproach. And it came to pass on the third day, when she was making an end of her prayer, blessing the Lord, she said, Blessed is thy name, O God of our fathers, who when thou hast been angry, wilt shew mercy, and in the time of tribulation forgivest the sins of them that call upon thee. At that time the prayers of them both were heard in the sight of the glory of the Most High God. And the holy angel of the Lord, Raphael was sent to heal them both, whose prayers at one time were rehearsed in the sight of the Lord. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm. Response, to you, O Lord, I lift my soul. In thee, O my God, I put my trust, let me not be ashamed. Neither let my enemies laugh at me, for none of them that wait on thee shall be confounded. Response, to you, O Lord, I lift my soul. Let all them be confounded that act unjust things without cause. Shew, O Lord, thy ways to me, and teach me thy paths. Direct me in thy truth, and teach me, for thou art God my Saviour. Response, to you, O Lord, I lift my soul. Remember, O Lord, thy bowels of compassion, and thy mercies that are from the beginning of the world. According to thy mercy remember thou me, for thy goodness sake, O Lord. Response, to you, O Lord, I lift my soul. The Lord is sweet and righteous, therefore he will give a law to sinners in the way. He will guide the mild in judgment, he will teach the meek his ways. Response, to you, O Lord, I lift my soul. Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia. I am the resurrection and the life, says the Lord, whoever believes in me will never die. Alleluia, Alleluia. Gospel, Mark 12, verses 18 to 27. And there came to him the Sadducees, who say there is no resurrection, and they asked him, saying, Master, Moses wrote unto us, that if any man's brother die, and leave his wife behind him, and leave no children, his brother should take his wife, and raise up seed to his brother. Now there were seven brethren, and the first took a wife, and died leaving no issue. And the second took her, and died, and neither did he leave any issue. And the third in like manner. And the seven all took her in like manner, and did not leave issue. Last of all the woman also died. In the resurrection therefore, when they shall rise again, whose wife shall she be of them? For the seven had her to wife. And Jesus answering, saith to them, Do ye not therefore err, because you know not the Scriptures, nor the power of God? For when they shall rise again from the dead, 
they shall neither marry, nor be married, but are as the angels in heaven. And as concerning the dead that they rise again, have you not read in the book of Moses, how in the bush God spoke to him, saying, I am the God of Abraham, and the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob? He is not the God of the dead, but of the living. You therefore do greatly err. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ.